السلام عليكم أعزائي طلبة المرحلة الثانية باسمه تعالى نبدأ المحاضرة الخامسة في Geology of GI Tract Today we will talk about the digestion process in the gastrointestinal tract As we mentioned, the food consists mainly of three items carbohydrate, fat, and proteins These substances cannot be absorbed unless digested by GI tract هذه المواد لا يمكن استفادة منها ولا امتصاصها إلا بعد أن يتم هضمها داخل قناة الجهاز الهضمي So here we will talk about the digestion of these items carbohydrate, fat and protein We will start by talking about digestion of carbohydrate Only three major sources of carbohydrate exist in the normal human diet, and these are sucrose, lactose, and starch. Sucrose, it is disaccharide known popularly as cane sugar. The sucrose هو disaccharide ومعروف بقصب السكر. Lactose, again, it is disaccharide but found in the milk. Lactose موجود في الحليب. Starches which are large polysaccharide present in potato and different types of grains. النشويات هي polysaccharide متعددة موجودة في البطاطا ومختلف أنواع الحبوب. Other carbohydrates available but in slight uh, amount which Uh, like uh, amylose, glycogen, lactic acid, pyruvic acid, and so on. But the main uh, major source of carbohydrates are sucrose, lactose, and starch. How the digestion process of carbohydrate occur? Draw carbohydrate digestion diagram. Talk about the digestion of carbohydrate. هذا سؤال مهم وارد بالامتحان. If you remember the, secre the secretory function of alimentary tract of each item, this will be so easy for you to remember. إذا إحنا ذكرنا واستفسرنا المحاضرة الثالثة والرابعة لإفرازات الجهاز الهضمي، راح تكون هذه المحاضرة جدا سهلة عليك. ممكن تتذكرها بسهولة. So, starch. or carbohydrates will be digested by salivary amylase alpha amylase نتذكر salivary amylase secreted by parotid uh, gland in the mouth so this will help in the digestion of the starch but few percent will be digested here the more percent that can be digested is by pancreatic Amylase. الكمية الأكبر اللي راح يتم هضمها هي بواسطة بنكرياتيك أميليز which is secreted into the duodenum. while the final stage الخطوة الأخيرة that digest all these substances into the simple form will occur in the small intestine by maltase Lactase and sucrase. So we have three steps starting, few percent starting by salivary amylase, the intermediate stage by pancreatic amylase, which secreted into the duodenum, and the last stage by small intestine. هذا الكلام نفس الذكرنا الآن. Here, within 15 to 30 minutes after the chyme emptied from the stomach into the duodenum and mixed with pancreatic juice, virtually all the carbohydrate will have become digested. The pancreatic amylase jitten faal within 15 to 30 minutes will convert the starch into the simple form, and the final stage will occur by small intestine, as we mentioned by this enzyme. فهذا السؤال إما ترسم أو 
تشرح كل خطوة بالتفصيل Second part of food is protein Digestion process of protein Draw diagram What is the digestion of protein Explain the digestion of protein هذا أيضا سؤال وارد بالامتحان So protein will be digested initially by pepsin نتذكر البيبسين بيبسينوجين سكريتد باي ستومك is inactive unless there is high pH high acidity reaching 2 to 3 2-3 pH so this pepsinogen will be converted into active pepsin so by this it will be able to digest to digest the protein into proteoses, peptone, polypeptide. So the initial step of digestion of a protein will occur by pepsin in the stomach. While the intermediate stage in the digestion of protein will occur by pancreatic secretion. Trypsin, chemotrypsin, carboxypolypeptidase, proelastase. These pancreatic secretion into the duodenum will digest the protein into polypeptide and few amino acid. While the final stage will occur by small intestine secreting peptidase which will convert all the polypeptide into simple form which is the amino acid فممكن ترسم الدياجرام أو ممكن تتكلم تشرح طريقة هضم البروتينات هذا نفس الكلام اللي ذكرناه and here uh, I want to talk about the peptidase. Pepti peptidase, initially, uh, you remember the microvilli, the Kamnah al Bruzat, with the Kamnah al Krebs. The microvilli contain enterocyte. In the previous lecture, we saw the shape and we saw it So, initially, microvilli will secrete peptidase which will convert the protein into simple form but it will convert into tripeptide, dipeptide not to the amino acid only few percent will be converted into the simplest one is amino acid then after that it will be uh, absorbed into the enterocyte نتذكر الانتيروسايت موجودة بالمايكروفيلاي this substance, tripeptide, dipeptide, will be absorbed into the inside the enterocyte. داخل الانتيروسايت. Here, there will be secretion of peptidase by enterocyte. تنفرز هذه المادة, which will convert all tripeptide, dipeptide, into simple form of amino acid. Then, it will be reabsorbed into the blood. And finally, the digestion of fat. The most abundant fat of diet are neutral fat. The dhuhn shaa هي طبيعية, also known as triglyceride. ممكن نسميها triglyceride. Neutral fat is major constituent in food of animal origin, and less in food of plant origin. إما يكون من أصل حيواني أو أصل نباتي. Also the diet can contain small quantity of phospholipid, cholesterol, and cholesterol ester. Cholesterol, it is not a fat. It is a sterol, but it is similar to the fat by physical and chemical characteristics. It metabolizes similarly to fat. So they considered as a fat. So how is it? The dhuhn be 
الخصائص الفيزيائية والكيميائية فلذلك اعتبره كدهون but it is a sterile compound how the digestion of fat process occur what is the digestion process talk about the digestion of fat هذا ايضا سؤال واضح في الامتحان so if you remember the fat ingestion will stimulate bile secretion from the gallbladder store to the duodenum uh, عندما نتناول الدهون هذا راح يحفز انه يخرج الم... الماده الصفراء من المرارة المخزن الى الاثني عشر so this will cause emulsified fat عملنا على استحلاب الدهون by this it facilitates to be in, uh, digested by the digestive enzyme فعملية استحلابها الدهون سهل عملية مهاجمتها بواسطة أنزيمات الهضم here the pancreatic lipase will uh, digest the emulsified fat into the simple form fatty acid and two monoglycerides and the final stage will occur by the intestinal lipase which split the neutral fat into the simple fatty acid so here initially it will be mixed with bile then intermediate stage it will be digested by pancreatic lipase on the final stage it will be digested by intestinal lipase فهذه ثلاث أسئلة وابدة بالامتحان ممكن تجي talk about the digestion of protein digestion of fat digestion of carbohydrate and according to the question either you will draw or you will explain and thank you so much